warm welcome to you by the Brian Mumbai Municipal Corporation Online Education and it is the statewide English medium and our class is standard fifth. The so subject is English. The topic is strawberries as you can see and the subtopic is homophones, nouns, opposites. Today's date July 15th and expert teacher myself Sir Sanjay Jiyadav and the expert technical team leader is Ratilal Kisan Burungale. So next we have the full panel expert teacher again myself Sanjay Yadav administrative officer Mrs. Srinayal Tata Dumbre nodal beat officer Mr. Sharad Kurade nodal HM Mrs. Pushpam Mary Paul assistant nodal HM Mrs. Manpreet Kaur <coughs> you know Mr. Ratilal Burungle now here we are starting a fresh new chapter on online classes in this pandemic. So, I want you to close your eyes and fold your hands and repeat after me. Can you hear me, students? Yes. The prayers for today. You repeat after me. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. For the world. For the world. So sweet. So sweet. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. For the food. For the food. We eat. We eat. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. For the birds. For the birds. That sing. That sing. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. For everything. For everything. Very nice. Now we can begin the lesson with a nice thought. Now, not every day is good, but there is uh, students, uh, there is something good in every day. Read it by Alice. Now, let the magic of today touch your life. Now, in the statewide lesson, you are going to watch. The class fifth subject is English. The topic is strawberries and the subtopics which we are going to cover is number one, noun words, number two, homophones, number three, opposite words, number four is the general knowledge or GK quiz, number five is the revision reading which you are going to do and help me. Number six is the homework. Now let's see which fruits are you seeing in the below picture? Strawberry. Very good. What are the colors of this strawberry? Red. Uh, can you see only single strawberry or many? Here you can see many juicy red strawberries. Okay. Now yes. we can see some opposite words like thin, the opposite is, can you tell me? Plum. Plum. Juicy, repeat. Juicy less. Juiceless, dry. Juiceless, dry. Sweeter. Sour. Sweeter and sour. Now wise is opposite is foolish. Foolish. Is opposite is death. No is Day. unknown. Unknown. Woodlands opposite is desert place. Desert. Now we are going to number eight. The emperor or the king. Opposite word of a king is commoner or a public. Number nine, youngest and opposite is oldest. Oldest. Number ten, silver. The opposite word is golden. golden. Very good. The eleventh one is the plate. The opposite word is bra ball. ball. So, number 12 is the villages. Opposite are the cities. cities. Number 13, another word, urban. So, opposite of urban is rural. Okay. Sugary, opposite is spicy. spicy. In the food, we, in the creamy, opposite is bland, bland or plain. plain. 
opposite of wild is tamed or domesticated number 17th naturally is opposite artificial now when we are talking about number 18 seven sown so when you sow something you are harvested something or you are plucking it so it is plucked so 19th is the trickling and thus it is gushing river okay okay now i'm reading this you have to just enjoy this uh, poem strawberries that in juicy in the gardens grow are plump and juicy fine strawberries that in gardens grow are plump and juicy fine but sweeter far as wise men know spring from the woodland wine but sweeter far as wise men know spring from the woodland wine no need for bowl or silver spoon now in the first paragraph of the poem this, there are strawberries they are growing in the garden they are plump they are very juicy they are red in color sweet in taste and more sweeter than any wise men around that in that village or in that place in the poet uh, imagination if there is a woodland there is a woodland is a forest in which there is the season is the spring where all the plants are growing and all the fruits cherries and berries are seen so now the poet goes there and she says no need for bowl or silver spoon you can see the small girl uh, who is the poet and uh, she's enjoying this says i don't need a bowl or a silver spoon there is a sugar there is a i don't need sugar i don't need spice i don't need cream now has the wild berry plucked in june so this is a wild berry it is not uh, being grown uh, in the previous days it was grown in the forest or in the farmlands or in the woodlands and beside the trickling stream there's a small stream going by so here you can read the word number one strawberries number two garden number three men number men. four june, june. june. Number five sugar sugar number Sugar. six Work. spoon, spoon. spoon. number seven woodland. Woodland. woodland number eight is the wine woodland. Uh, number nine is the spring. spring. Number ten, cream. cream. Number eleven, stream. stream. So these, are, these are all the dictation words which you have to write down in your notebook and show to your teachers. Okay. Now, uh, just listen. Strawberries. This is the first of its kind in the poem about natural things. Strawberries were bought by European. It came from Europe. It was not an original plant and it was planted around in hill station areas with moderate rainfall. So we have seen that since the British rule, East India Company, the cultivation of strawberry grew much in demands as it was considered exporting cash crop after sugarcane, cotton and spices, garam masalas, farms, Farmers had to toil in hilly farmlands owned by British landlords and upper class Indian money lenders and property. So since the 18th century, strawberry farm laborers were in demand, especially in Lonavla, Khandala and Mahabaleshwar and Panjgani in Maharashtra hilly regions. This is the weather in these areas is very colder in the winter and rainy season and moderate in summers. So the strawberry industry grew up. Nowadays, you can see the Mapro and Kisan company, which has given us many bottled syrups, jams, jelly filled with candies and tarts or even chocolates and jelly and even pickles. 
we all like to spread the strawberry jam on hot parathas and bread toast. Yes, children, we enjoy strawberry ice candy and ice creams too. Now, how would you like to eat your strawberries? Who can give me the answer? I would like to eat my strawberries directly without adding any sugar or cream. Because when these things are added, the natural flavor of the fruit is lost. Very good. Now, in the Mahabaleshwar strawberry, the strawberry is got a special name because it's it was first planted in Mahabaleshwar and grown in the hilly slopes of Mahabaleshwar, which accounts for about 85% of the total strawberry that is grown in India. Total 85% strawberry along with raspberry, another variety, mulberry and gooseberry is produced on large scale in and around Mahabaleshwar. Now Mahabaleshwar strawberry got the geographical tag, GI tag in 2010. Now in the fill in the blanks, the dash that grow in the woodlands are more sweeter and plump. What is the answer? Strawberry. Strawberry. Strawberries. Yes, T. Yes, T. R A R A W B E E double R Y. Double R Y. Yes, it is very correct. S T R A W B E R R Y. Strawberry. We go to the next one. Dash is a hill station. Famous for cultivation and export, 85% local Hello. strawberry fruit. Hello. Yes, tell Ma me the answer spelling. What is the name of that hill station spelling? Mahabaleshwar. Very good, children. Now, we go to the third one. Natural strawberry can be mixed into jams and milkshakes dash dash and dash so there are three dashes you have to write what can you tell me the first dash name jelly candy jelly candies very good the second dash syrup. syrups very good that is a syrupy liquid and the third the, the fill in the blank Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Very good. Now, right, you can see the picture. Can you describe this picture? What you can see? Strawberry. Strawberry. You know, strawberry is the color. Red. Red. And how many can you see? Many. There are many. Lots there, of. There are, there are lots and lots of. Now. The history strawberries were bought in the region from Australia during the British colonial rule and Mahabaleshwar was the summer capital of the Bombay Presidency under the British Raj. Since then, local farmers have developed their own varieties of the fruit, some of which are imported from other places. Now, find out when and where we get strawberries in Maharashtra. Who will give me the answer? In, in Maharashtra, Maharashtra strawberries, strawberries are, are grown in, in Panchagani and, and Mahabaleshwar. Very the good. Now, one is, okay, you have to tell me your name first and then you can read the next paragraph. Rudaya Parab. Rudaya Parab. My name is Jidnesa Savarkar. The My strawberry season is seen from November up to the month of March every seasonal year. Very good. The strawberry season, it starts from November, December, January and up to the month of February and March every seasonal year. Very good. You are clever. Now make a list. The next question comes. Make a list of your favorite fruits and vegetables. It is given in your textbook and note down the time of the year when they are available in plenty. Now the answer is among the fruits, I like strawberries and mangoes. Strawberries, they are available in plenty from November up to March. Mangoes are available in plenty in the summer season, especially in the 
May. Now here we are not only talking about strawberries, but we are talking about fruits and vegetables. And now we have been in the question they have asked us to tell us the time of which month they are available in plenty. In the B part, among the vegetables, I like cauliflower and ladyfinger. And the C part, you have to write students, cauliflower is found in plenty in the winter season while the ladyfinger is available all round the year. Who can read this starting to end? So can I read? Yes. So can I Among read? the fruits, I like strawberries and mangoes. Strawberries are available in plenty from November up to March. Mangoes are available in plenty in the summer season, especially in May. B. Among the vegetables, I like cauliflower and ladyfinger. C. Cauliflower is found in plenty in the winter season, while the ladyfinger is available all round the year. Very good. Excellent. Let us go to the next one. What does this last line say? You can see such a nice, beautiful picture, isn't it? Yes. Yes. Read the last line, children. Strawberries that, that in, a in garden, garden grow are, are plump and juicy fine. fine. So, you can see there are so many dots in that. So, these dotted parts uh, are... The, are the seeds so in one it is na, this is the stem of that fruit so this in one you can see 200 uh, seeds so you actually you are seeing 200 strawberries in the seed form so the, and all are juicy red and inside they are plum and white juice and uh, uh, it is they are so fresh directly from the vine. Now, have you, next question, have you eaten any fruit or vegetable, picking it straight from the tree or the field? Now, you can write your experience in three to five lines. Answer will be, yes, yes. I have, yes, read it. Yes, I have eaten strawberries directly after plucking it from the strawberry bush. We had gone to Mahabaleshwar and were staying at a friend's place where they had strawberries drawn. Okay, stop. Now this uh, is telling the answer that yes, I had gone uh, to the strawberry farm. I had seen the strawberry bush and I had gone there staying in a friend's place, in a friend's house where there was a farm. Now, this second part will be read by another child. We were invited to the farm and the sight of the strawberries was so beautiful. We were told to pluck as many strawberries and also popping a few strawberries into our mouths. Now this, they were, uh, the poet was invited with her family to the farm and the sight of the strawberries was very beautiful. You can see the so nice pictures over here. So you have enjoyed these pictures over here, which you see. Now the same way, the she was the poet uh, girl, she was told that to pluck as many strawberries there was no stopping she was told that by the farmer over there that you can as many strawberries you can pluck and juicy as you all wanted so she and her friends they started plucking and also popping in popping means the action of eating a few strawberries into our mouths now the last the third student can read it was a wonderful experience eating the fruit directly from the tree. Now, this was a wonderful experience. Now, you can see here, the strawberries are found in thin vines and in red, juicy, plumpy bunches near to each other. This makes it easier to grow and harvest this production. 
Now this India is 85% major exporter of the strawberries in the world. There are almost 20 different qualities species of strawberries. Now this is part is the general knowledge which I am talking about. Yes students, strawberry plant is called as bushes and herbs in the science. They are small reddish. It is like a cone, just like an ice cream cone. It is very sweeter and sour in taste. Now, strawberry has got many richness in very min minerals and vitamins. So, if you are eating even one strawberries, it is equal to eating 200 fruits. So, that much of energy it is packed in that. So, because you are picking it fresh from the farm. The cone-shaped fruit is actually a stem and has 200 small holes. So, we can see that we are actually seeing 200 fruits in one piece. Roughly, we see strawberry as a heart shape. It is shaped like a conical shape, but it is more like your heart. We get ripened strawberries mainly in the summer season or from March to June. It's called as the main harvest time in the hilly gardens. Now, strawberries, can you read this last line? Strawberries are bright red in color, aromatic, juicy and very tasty fruit. Okay, aromatic. This word tells us that the sweet smell, it is color is also bright red. That is also very pleasing to the eye. And for our tongues, it is definitely a very tasty fruit. Let's see what are the nutritional benefits of eating. Strawberry is a good source of folic acid. It is good for women's health. It reduces birth defects. It has got potassium, maintains fluids, promotes faster healing when we fall down and our uh, we get hurt. This uh, potassium in our blood promotes faster healing and dietary fiber and vitamin C supports our to make our body more stronger and grow properly. Manganese and calcium which are there in this uh, fruit helps in making our bones stronger. Now which are the um, answer the following which are the two different places where the strawberries grow? Strawberries grow. Strawberries grow in farm garden and beside bullets strictly streams. Okay, very good. What are the three different ways of eating strawberries? Can you say? Strawberry can be eaten with jams, ice creams, and in strawberry milkshakes. Very good. Strawberries can be eaten in jams, ice creams, and strawberry milkshakes. Now, which strawberries are plump and juicy? Strawberries in the fruit garden grown are plump and juicy. Okay, which strawberries are sweeter? Strawberries that are bright, reddish, plumpy, and having more lighter pulp inside, it are called as a ready sweeter strawberry. Uh, one at a time, students. Now you can just listen. Strawberries that are bright, they are reddish, plumpy, and having more whiter pulp inside it, they are called as ready to eat. And they are sweeter strawberries. Next, how would you like to eat strawberries in your home? I, I would like, like to just to cut small cut slices of strawberry, strawberry and, and put it and on a bread toast. Sir, can I? Sir, can I? Yes. Can I, sir, can I? I would like to just cut small slices of strawberry and put it on a bread toast. I will apply mayonnaise or peanut butter on both the bread slices. After placing the strawberry slices, I will close it like a sandwich and have it with tea or coffee. I will apply mayonnaise or peanut butter 
on both the bread slices and after placing the strawberry slices inside those both parts of the bread slice i will close it like a sandwich and have it with the tea or coffee very good you are all clever students now students let's learn how to tell one word from another spellings this is the finding out and is called homophones and are known to us as homophones like in the left picture there a girl is holding two words i and hear here here the same sound is coming but the word spelling is changing e y e i and here is different from h e a r here on the left side the right side it is here that means now this place and here is hearing so i and i here and here these are same sounds i and i these are many words in the sound the same now this is left side is an ant ant but right side the picture is showing a person it is an ant ant so only one u alphabet that is a vowel sound is put in between now Peace, peace on peace. the left side means that peace. we are sitting quietly in one place and have a piece of cake so cake or a pastry piece. so this piece this spelling can you say p p a c e e piece p i e c e piece very good the right side is a piece of cake now There is hole. a hole. 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 Now, and hole. if you are hole. making a sentence with the word hole, we can say there is. I can see a hole in the tree. So now we will not write W H O L E. We will write H O L E. Now, hole. if I want to order a pizza, I will not write. I want a H O L E pizza. I will write. I want the W H O L E whole pizza. W H O L E. Next, this is the tail of the lion. Tail. So the spelling is T A I L. Now the right side spelling. Who can tell me? T A A L E tail. Okay. Can you make a sentence with that word? I love fairy tales. I love to read fairy tale or I love to hear fairy tales. And what about the left side? Tiger tail is very big. The lion tail is very big. Very good. You are a clever children. So this is a tick mark. It right. Is, it is a right, right. mark. Right. R I G H T. Right. I write. R I T E. Right. Yes, I write right. the word in my book. Now these are homophones. So homophones are different spellings, but with the but same, same sound. sound. it is coming homophones are different spellings but with the same sound now you can see a beautiful picture of a girl she has yeah. got a hair band and nicely yes. combed hair. hair right side there is a picture of a small rabbit which is called yeah. hair so yeah. hair and hair she has combed her hair and i different can... spelling but sound same yes can you make a sentence with the left side picture she girl hair is very beautiful very good now next what is a homophone homophones are words that you pronounce and same but they have different meanings now you can learn something new every day just like this now up till now you have listened but you have to listen very carefully now Eight e eight. He ate a sandwich. Now number eight is I worked eight hours today. Sun. S u n sun. S u n sun. And here the sun down is the child. My the son, son is four is months eight. old. Now this I? picture on top is the eye. My eye hurts. E y e. Now I, I am the teacher. Now this I is talking eight. about me. I am a teacher. 
Now next one is the sea. I can, I see, can you. see you. And I live by the sea. sea. I live by sea. Now sum. This if we say three plus four, one is equal to four. So now we are adding this. So the sum of three and one is four. Now this we are writing in the sentence form. Now there are some bananas on the table. On the table. Now she blew we the flower petals, petals in the wind. Now blue is my favorite, favorite color. color. Spelling you have to be very careful. It is B L U E. Okay, next one is I can hear the baby yeah. cry. Now here the pizza is here on the table. Now this. Right. Yes, read the sentence. I like, I like to, to write letters, letters to, to my, my mom. mom. Okay. R I G H T right. Turn right on Elm Street. Elm Street. Very good. Excellent. Now, dear. Now, this is an e -double -E -R, dear. Yeah. Read the sentence. The deer the jumped, jumped over a log. Ah, now, in the next King, picture is the she is my dear, dear friend. She now, is my dear friend. She is writing about her friend. Now, I buy. You buy, buy. You buy, buy. So, from the pocket, that picture is saying removing the yeah. rupee notes. Okay, yeah. or dollar bills. Buy. Now, B -Y, B -Y, buy, buy. They are they buy. Are buy so, me. that I can see in the picture. So, yeah. we have to associate whatever we are writing with the picture. So, picture and the sentence. So, they are by the lake. Next. Way I weigh way. myself every day. Every day. And way. way. Which way do Which I way have to turn? Now there is a sign board. So left side sign arrow, right side arrow. Now root. root. This root is root. The root is the root is root. The root is the root is underground. Okay. And next one is the map. So arrow you one at a time, one at a time. Now this, what route do I get to go to your house? Next is about the weather. The weather, weather. is nice today. And I don't yeah. know whether to stay or to go. Now this also sound is coming same. Weather, weather. So now yeah. this weather is W H E T H E R. Wet the now weather okay. Next is a night. Night at the moon. I, at night. I like to, I like to, like to la look at the moon. I like at to night. look at the moon at the night. Okay. Now and this, the night. Now and this night. is a soldier. And now this soldier spelling is K N I G H T. So night is there only K has been added. So this the night. This night we are talking about the soldier is very the night. This night is very brave. The road, road. The is on the road. Now she rode her horse. Now there's a lady riding the horse. Evaluation. Now tick mark the correct homophone. They sound all alike, but they have got different spellings and different meanings. Oh my dear, D E A R D E E R. Which one you will choose? D E E R. D E E R. Oh, D E E R is wrong. D E E R is the picture. It is an animals. So, yeah. which word is right or right? R I G H T. N O T. R I G H T. W R I T E. Right. R I G H T. R I G H T is the correct answer. So, you only say the spelling of the tick mark. Which word is not or not? N O T yeah, not. 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 Very good. Which word is P L A N E plain or P L A I N plain? P L A N E plain. Very good. Now, R E I G N rain or R A I N rain? Which one? R A I N rain. Because it's a picture. It's a waterfall. So R and our. Yes, R, you H O U R, R. R. So R. R. Yes, because we are telling time. Now, flower or flower? Flower. L O W E R. L O W E R. Flower. 
very good excellent next now this is the uh, you can uh, when this video is uploaded you can take the screenshot you can play this video again and you can write this revision uh, homophones you can pause the video here and you can then write it in your notebooks okay so okay. one any one sentence who will read he was he yes. was s e n t on an errand to the store very good it is s e n t so it is correct very good next one let's bury bury or treasure yeah so let us bury our treasure so which uh, which way is the beach W H I C H. W H I C H. Which way is the beach? So you have got it. Now let us go to the next one. Now I am giving you a small homework. You have to question number one. You write the poem strawberries and show it to your teach okay. English teacher online when you have the class and yes. in your WhatsApp group. Question number two is use the correct words in the sentences below. I will read on the full sentence, but you have to say only the correct spelling word. Gopi enjoys dash strawberry jam toast. Eating. E A T I N G eating. E A T I N G eating. Minu dash strawberry milkshake yesterday. Drank. A T I N G. D R A N K. D R A N K. Drank. is not eating we don't eat a milkshake many children will write eating so we eat a solid uh, a fruit but then when it is a milkshake we are drinking so drank minu drank the and the word is yesterday it is so we have to be careful here our school is dash but we like to learn strawberry lessons no Was. Our school is closed, but we like to learn strawberry lessons. Very clever, very good, excellent. Question number three: Write using the correct opposite words of plump will be. It will be thin. T h i n thin. It will be t h i n thin. For juicy, it will be the first word plump. Now yeah. raw. R A W raw. It right. will be R I P E ripe. Very good. Right. Now here is again a small worksheet which you can take a screenshot afterwards and you can complete it. Okay. I'm just okay, doing sir. the first one. After he was sick for several days, his face was P A L E P A L E P A L E P A L E P A L E A R. उसका चेहरा उतर गया, so his his face became weak. So P that is not P A I L, it is P A L E. She purchased a beautiful new gown for or for the dog. For. F O R. For. For. Okay. Walking walking down the uh, A I S L E aisles to get married can be scary. Grass containers have been banned B A N N E D on the beach. The baker systematically kneaded the dough or dough D O U G H for the bread. D O U G H. Very good. I'd rather receive my mail electronically than on paper. So it is M A E M A I L. Very good. He was considered bald or bald. Because he had no hair. B A L D bald. Bald. Very good. B A D B D bald. Now go to the ninth one. My favorite string instrument is the B A S S bass because it is so big. The fight dash scene S C E N E is in the movie was extremely exciting. So he was already tired. The farmer had to sow, sow, sow the seeds. 
Yes, also. Yes, also. Already tired. But if you write children, S O, it will be wrong. S E W also wrong. But S O W is the right option. Annabella sat on the bottom of the stair. S T A I R without being noticed. S T A I R. After running out of. Now here you have to give me the answer. What is the F L O U R. Very good. And it is the floor. F L. Uh, it is not the floor. It is the atta. So it is called the F L O U R of the wheat, the wheat powder. The baker had to stop baking. Fierce winds dash blew B L E W all night during the thunderstorm. Rover sat and scratched the place where the dash flea bit him. So F L E A. So F L E A is that insect. The government has the right to dash the stolen property. Is the last one? Can you say the last word? The S E I Z E. S E I Z E. Seize. Mitlab to take away. So the government took away because it was a stolen property. Now. Thank you very much. Hope Thank you, sir. Strawberry, you have understood. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. Sir.